YouTube. Today I went back to Gum Run and uh, Derringer, all them places down that way. I went back to this uh, Drift Tunnel 38 that I already did a video on, but I was looking at mine maps, and like I said, there's a little uh, depression here. According to mine maps, that, that was a shaft. So I did go back there today and found it. I did find it, so uh, I'll show you that in a bit. the hill to get up to that place. I believe that hole was a shaft above this uh, tunnel here. This old collapsed tunnel that I was at about a week ago. Okay, I'm coming back down here to the to that area. Last week. Quite the walk. Whew, quite the hill. I was way up in there. But according to mine maps, a shaft should be in that depression. Which I'm not gonna poke around in there because you never know. I could fall deep into a mine and nobody would ever find me. <clears throat> but yeah, here's this, again, this big trench. And the bridge I was at, where the old DSNS crossed over. why but I didn't see that insulator this time. Oh it's still there. Yeah it's still there. <laughs> Big piece of metal here. It's tripped over it. What a hell of a piece of pipe. Yeah, my phone died on me. I went to use my phone today, and I thought I had the battery charged. Unfortunately, I didn't. But now, now I'm walking east on the ds and &S Railroad. Some kind of concrete here. I don't know if there's a signal there. What? Got a beautiful little path. Still the laurels. And they've still got remnants of old railroad uh, ties here. So, just making my way back to the car. Parked right over here. Somewhere in there. I don't know, there's like a lower road here. I don't know if this was another part of a railroad or not. It's flat. It has the look, but I don't know. Whew, it's cold out. It's only in the 40s. I don't even have a jacket on. Yeah, it's a beautiful day again. Making my way out to my car here. And uh, what is this? Fern Glen. 
Yeah, for England. So. Yeah, I also pulled over here along the Tom Hicken Road, and I found this side road going up the mountain, which I thought was the DSNS Railroad, but it's actually right here, going east to west. So I, you know, wanted to see a section of this. This is an extremely old railroad, but you can see how it went across the mountain. You can see the, you know, the the uh, imprint of uh, how it went along. And that almost looks like a spur right there. Maybe it was. Who knows? And it go. It went through Tom Hicken. This is Tom Hicken here. And it continued along. Let's see here. Yeah, it continued along the mountain and down down in the woods and that. But it actually ended up in these workings right here. I mean, the railroad disappears right here where I have the mouse. You can't see any more of the impression of it because, you know, it got removed from mining and that. But yeah, there was a lot of workings here on the top of this mountain, and that's basically where this railroad ended because there's no more evidence of it going west. As you can see here, there's, there's nothing. So, yeah, I wanted to check, you know, part of that out today, too. Okay, more in a bit. Yeah, I'm just walking through the woods here, trying to find another section of the DSNS Railroad. I know it came across the top of this mountain. Well, not the top, but... There was uh, coal mines up this way. And I think I found it. quite the picture, but, yeah, this matches up with the, with the uh, map I was using, <clears throat> not very flat, but it is a road, is it possible it was this steep, or was this a truck road? It is pretty steep in this section right here. Oh, wait a minute. No, I'm wrong. That's okay. I've been wrong before. Yeah, this is the DSNS here. All right here. Nice and flat. Hey, you see? Goes off that way and down that way. Yeah, this railroad bed is extremely old. You can see how far away from the road I am. I thought that this was it right here. Wrong answer. And yeah, my car's down there somewhere. I can't really see it, but. I'm parked down in there somewhere. So yeah, I wanted to see this other section of the DSNS. I believe this was DSNS. As I said, you can see how flat it is. And this this railroad bed went from the Hazelton area down to uh, I'm not even sure what the name of that place is. It went past. It went through Tom Hicken and alongside the mountain ridge. And there are old workings up there. Uh, I'll do a better explanation at home on maps to show you like where I was. But, uh, I'm really getting my exercise today. <laughs> a lot of walking up mountains. Just call me the mountain man. Where's my car? Oh, there's my car. Over there. I can't zoom with this. This stupid phone don't zoom. But, uh, I think it's a little bit of a walk out of the woods. Not a nice day. It got a little warmer <laughs> since I'm on the sun, sunny side of the mountain now. The 
before that before when I was down there by that trench I was on the south side of the mountain. It's a little colder. There's my car. We're, we're not lost. So. Well, that'll do it for today, absolutely. I gotta go home now and put some more information in about this video and some maps up and stuff. And, and you always find old beer bottles, don't you? I don't know whose brand that was. Huh. Okay, YouTube. Thanks for watching. Thanks for coming along. Please subscribe. See you all again later. Bye-bye.